it's me, Carmine Stefano, the Book Man. The Destiny 2 open beta is now available. I think I got my email about the closed beta that I was supposed to have, considering I pre-ordered it like two months ago. And I might have misplaced it or something like that, but the closed beta was a few days ago. Now the open beta is available on the PS4 and the Xbox One. Not the PC, not yet. No, 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 because Destiny, from what I've heard, did not come out on PC. The original Destiny, that is. And I've played through about half an hour of it. It seems okay. I mean, if you're a Destiny fan, I'm sure you're going to get Destiny 2. If you're not, you've never played Destiny 1. It's open, it's completely free, which is my favorite price, as you all know. So I would definitely suggest taking a look at it. What Destiny is, it's Bungie, the people that made the shitty Halo games, but we'll get to that later. It's them taking their first-person shooter aspects and putting it into an MMORPG-style format. Now, I played the first one. I was playing through it on CD Bookman Gaming, my other channel, one of my other channels, when that came out a few years ago. A lot of people had problems with the storyline developments. A lot of people had problems with the DLC not having that much content to it. But Destiny 2 apparently is Bungie's attempt to rectify all of those little issues that they have. And from what I've played so far, it seems challenging. I mean, they soup you up huge. You've got just jacked up c capacity, the armor sets, the weapons, everything about it. So you can use all the different weapon types and probably not the best weapons, but really high level weapons in each type. You can use your grenades. You know, there's no real character building. You're just kind of going through what's happening. And what's happening is that your home base, main hub, is being attacked by a certain faction of the Cabal. And the Traveler, the big orb thing that gives everybody their, all the Guardians anyway, their abilities and what have you, that is being hijacked by them. So the graphics look really good. The characters, the designs are really, really keen, especially on the cutscenes. But the enemies seem kind of goofy, which is a Halo thing. Like, Bungie makes goofy enemies. I don't know why. So, they're not very intimidating, the Cabal, the ones that you're playing. But they're different character types. And they're different character designs from the last one, which was another complaint that some people had, that the characters, the enemies are all the same build and everything. So, like I said, it's completely free. It's totally open to anybody. If you have a PS4 and an Xbox One, if you were thinking about getting Destiny 2, or you or a Destiny fan, as I've said, or you were perturbed by Destiny, or you never played the game before, check it out. It's free. It's available right now. So, take a look. Let me know what you think. Thank you all for watching. I have more for you soon to come, so stay tuned, take care, and have a great day.